Good day student and welcome to biology class and today we continue our class on the past question and solution to the year 2018 and question 18. So the structure for gaseous exchange in breathing root is dash, A is tomata, B lenticels, C corticle and D mitochondria. So what's the answer? Yes, the answer is the stomata. The stomata is, is a, that particular pore that is located at the lower surface of the leaf. Okay, it's found in a leaf. Why lenticels? They are cork cell, dead cells that are found at the bark of a stem. That is good. So the answer is tomato. What is breathing roots? Breathing roots are a form of aerial. Aerial means something above the soil. A form of aerial roots that are found in the mangroves. They are responsible for gaseous exchange. And since they are found, they are aerial roots. Okay, they are aerial roots found above, above the soil. So we're going to have them. We're going to have the stomata responsible for the gaseous exchange. So let's go to the next one. The adult insect in the life, this life cycle is dash. Now let's look at this. We have the egg to larva. Let me number it for you. We have the egg, we have the larva, we have the pupa, and we have the adult. This is called a complete metamorphosis. Okay? An example of organisms that or insects that undergo complete metamorphosis are, we have the housefly, we have the butterfly, while the cockroach undergo incomplete metamorphosis. So let's try to identify the adults of this particular life cycle, where we have the larva and we have the, we have the pupa. So the pupa is, in, is located on a tree, something like a tree, and this is going to give us tree branch, and it's going to give us a clue on how to get the adult. So let me give you a particular formula, butterfly can cry, Mosquito we try. Let's grab butterfly can cry. Mosquito will will try. So for butterfly, the larva stage is caterpillar. Okay? The while the adult the pupa stage is what? It's chrysalis. Is what? It's chrysalis. So let me spell the chrysalis for you so that you will not get it wrong. So you know, you can spell caterpillar. So for mosquito, the, the larva state is called the regular. Let me spell the regular for you. So it's a regular. While the tri is for, is for tumbler, that is the pupa stage of the of mosquito. So let's answer the question. The answer is going to be butterfly. Okay, because the butterfly is always outside the house and it's as his own pupa at the branch of a of a tree. So let's go to the next uh, next question. Five, number twenty. The lava is also known as the lava stage of that question. It's also known as a nymph, b maggot, c caterpillar, d chrysalis. So what's the formula I give you? The formula for butterfly is what? Butterfly can cry. And I told you that the larva stage is chrysalis, is, is caterpillar. That's what I told you. The larva stage is caterpillar, while the pupa stage is chrysalis. So the answer is caterpillar. Now, the source of energy required by plants during food production is that it's the simplest. I know that the answer is not going to be photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is a process, it's not going to be chlorophyll. Chlorophyll is a green pigment. Okay, why the sunlight is the source of energy required for photosynthesis. Goodbye, we'll meet in the next class.